Hey guys, what's going on? It is Roger Death here, and we're back with Crusader Kings 2. And I'm a bit of a dumbass, um, for two reasons. My counting in the previous videos has been off due to that massive one, and I was stopped paying attention. And at the end of the last one, I actually didn't save. So I'm having, I was gonna redo this all off camera and get back to roughly the point where we are, but, uh, this happened. So we're gonna start from here. We're still in this, this war over here. It's going, you know, well, we're gonna win. There's no question about that. Uh, but now uh, we are going to master flat terrain. So this makes us a more competent fighter. Uh, it's in the flat areas of the world, which of course are plenty. Not where I'm from, but where I'm from is also not represented here, so whatever. Out here, flat is... F you're being funny if you're calling this flat. It's not even hilly, it's just absolutely giant uh, mountains everywhere. Giant mountains. Where did that army just go? Did they just bug out? <laughs> they just bugged out of the war. They're like, eh, yeah, screw this shit. That's actually really hilarious. I haven't seen that. So, we are going to uh, get the surrender. We will take it. We actually finished this earlier than we did before. Which is really nice. Uh, you need to be led by... I need a... Yeah. Him, what are his traits actually? He is a skilled tactician, so he is he is a good person to be leading the army. Cause this is my one that stays this is my retarine. Heavy cavalry, apparently a bullshit. Have that guy lead this side of the army and that one there. So he's got the cavalry. He's a misguided warrior. He's got health for it. He gets bonus health though. Oh, but, uh... Oh, and he's Roth. He's got a new, ooh, a Berserker. Uh, that's great for the cavalry, I think. It sounds like it's going to be great for the cavalry, at least. Alright, then. Let's try this again. Grant landed title. The place we just took in all titles below it. Why is my... Oh, yeah, because my stewardship is, like, non-existent. <laughs> Because my I have a shitty stu look I, got a, I have a less shitty steward now, so that'll help out with my stewardship. Uh, okay, so all my units are now out, and I'm debating on this on uh I think we're, what we're gonna do is uh, since there's no real one county I mean I guess there's Iceland that we could start taking over but Iceland's worthless man, like it's just too far out of the way it's a in the ass to deal with. Uh, I suppose... Uh, we could be dealing with... Uh, one of these other... places here, over here. I think this is a... one county little place. Yeah, it might be worth going to take over. Uh, problem is, I don't know what my ship situation looks like. As I discussed, I don't want to create the uh, Kingdom of England just yet. That's going to fracture my guys up way too much. And I just want to... Uh, he's a prince? Oh, he's my brother. Okay. Um, yeah, I have a Jarldom I need to get rid of. The Jarldom of Jorvik. Congrats, dude. You are the Jarl of Jorvik. Praise be to you. How many boats do we have? Okay, we can actually do this. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh, I guess I should check to see if he's got allies first. He does? Oh, God. 
Killing the king of Denmark, but uh, he's actually not in a position to really deal with me. Neither is the Jarl of Yeland. So I think we'll be good. Especially since I can uh, get 25 men over there, just kinda. I don't give a shit about you. Ulster is. Uh, he's got raiders. Going. Load up over there into the ship. And this is kind of bullshit because we can do this. It's a sh it's a, not an army levy, but I can do it. It's really funny how that works out. Oh, I don't want to use my subjugation there. That's the only claim I have on that? Never mind. Oh, so Lincoln now owns this one county over here. Uh, Lane. Scotland is... Jesus. This is going to be a nightmare. I really don't know how else to say this. Uh, You're a dick. You know what? Fine. I'll know troops right on your face. Hi. Die. Load troops up. Uh, they just disappeared. As my guys were always like, hey, we're not settling for this shit. Alright, so I want to now assassinate this man. Which is not going to happen. Uh. Uh. The independence factions are really annoying. Of course, they take my chancellor with them. However, I can start giving them trouble right away. Oh, apparently they're faster than my guys, which makes it absolutely zero sense. All right, let us uh, raise troop levies in areas that aren't under siege and under attack and kind of draw them back into defensible uh, places you're just gonna disband and you are just gonna disband I mean at least I can be a pain in the... oh crap okay it's only another 3,000 men I can do this. This actually isn't as bad as it sounds them getting a lot more men. Because at the same time, uh, the amount of men they have is actually comparable to how many I have. So I need to bring these ships down over here. Load them up into the ships. And bring them over here. Is that what I can do? Is make a big blob of death here. really efficient at killing things. How efficient? Well, I think we're going to kill these guys. I don't know. Why do they have so much war score? Oh, because you control. They control all their holdings. Um, the downside here is that you're about to lose a shit ton because lol. You want to bring in a death blob? I'll bring a death blob. It's the death ball. It's, a, it's the, uh, the Scottish Death Ball. Seen hundreds of that, or probably thousands of years before <laughs> the Protoss Death Ball was invented and used against uh, the Terran. Why did I go this way? The army didn't go this way. Actually, it looks like the army just completely disbanded. Why am I going there? I should come down here to ravage this army that I can't catch because they're dicks. Uh, 
just my foul impulses. Uh, what am I working on? Uh, my diplomacy and my stew, my uh, intrigue are high enough. That's coolly seatful. Now I can plot to kill people better. Uh, the nice part is, is that Cornwall has risen up and is going to kill everybody <laughs> for me. So I need to get these guys down here. And we will do a flanking attack here. Bam! Get wrecked, boy. Hopefully? Yes. Wasn't fun for anybody. We, we both took some pretty severe losses. Uh, he lost more, obviously, but uh, it's um, some pretty severe. How much... Holy crap, I got a lot of war score just because I killed them. That is insane. The nice thing is, is that they raise basically everybody they can right away. They get tiny amounts of rainfall. Oh, what? What? I'm my brother's... Oh. I need to kill him. If I can kill him, what is my, let's see what my plot power gets up to before I jump to the conclusion and just kill him. Because if I do that, I can take this all back just instantly. Bam. Only have this shit to deal with here. Which, um, kind of a bit. Oh, wait, that's actually. Also, there's now apparently. So, whatever. Uh, the Cuman War for the Kingdom of Ireland. Yes, I will. I will absolutely be part of this war. I'd be be silly if I wasn't. Because this gets it back in the power of uh, my family. So how's that war score looking? Yeah, you're not in charge of all your places now, are you? So your war score's not like stupid high. Uh, what's gonna be the war score ticker here? Oh shit, a lot of reinforcements. Oh wait, doesn't matter. I don't need to siege that. Offer peace. Enforced demands. No sieging. Let him rot, and it's time to retake everything. This is what I mean. It's like, you never know what's going to happen in Crusader Kings 2. We're going to increase our castle infrastructure. And, uh, our majesty. Yeah. And high, big uh, boomstick. And uh, sorry about that. I accidentally hit my mic because I'm dumb. And there goes his troops there. Unfortunately, I hope we don't have to deal with this tomb blob over there. My argument would be uh, no, because they're trying to get these counties over here, and as long as we can control them, 
they should be able okay, let's siege that out. Oh no. People are finding out that I'm killing my brother. I'm trying oh my god. I actually have enough. I actually got enough four score. Uh, if I could get this spy master, it would be insane. This is going to be risky. Like, very difficult, but as long as my sieges succeed. Uh, it's not as risky as it would be normally. So I've got a lot of men here. And uh, they decided they're going to siege. Is that not enough? I, I don't know what else to do. What I really can do. I can't get to their other stuff very quickly, and I probably wouldn't be able to put up a much of a fight against them. So I say we're just going to stay here and we're going to do ticking war score. So we're going to move our men back into Scotland. Ah, uh, not intrigue many to dismiss the levies. And we're going to declare the uh, conquest of Northampton. It's nice that I can raise troops again. <laughs> Stupid civil wars. I hate them. Any, and I don't know who doesn't. Oh, uh, never mind. You get over here. You guys get over here. So that I can dismiss. And uh, is this ruled by the same guy? It is. Marshall has died. He is. You congratulate. You are now my new. What's his name? The new Marshall. I think War Score is ticking in our favor. I I really can't tell. Um. I can't sue for peace either. I would like it if uh, my massive plot power could be used for something. I'm just watching to see if this ticks up. And I guess it doesn't cost me much to go check out uh, what's going on over here. Oh, that's right, I can use, I can use the rivers, because I'm Norse. I have Norse culture. Or is it Nor- it's- oh, it's Norse religion that allows me to do this. Yep. Can navigate major rivers. Okay, cool. Um... Let's increase tolerance. Wait, is that something else? Let's increase town infrastructure. I thought I did that, but I guess not. Um, Lower Crown Authority in Scotland. Not gonna happen. That's my ambition. Have a son. Because you don't have your. We claim on the Duchy of Transylvania. Oh, that's right, the heart of the 
Hungarian Empire. Considering what I've already seen Hungary do, I'm really not inclined to uh, enjoy it. Come over here to Azov, where I'm sure it's going to be a pain in the ass to see. Oh, wow, actually, not really. I just have to be careful of other guys. Because this can be useful. If I can just use this small force. And be like, yeah, I'm going to. Oh, good, we're looking to kill him. And carriage to the trap. <laughs> uh, so, everybody knows we were involved. Right then, <laughs> let's usurp that title, get it away from them, because I don't want them to have it. Uh, so yeah, I have uh, I have Scotland now. Which is pretty cool. It is what we were going after. Can I now try and assassinate, I can assassinate him hopefully. And that should make it so that he's no longer going to try and kill us. I, I say should because the Lord only knows. Let's invite a few nobles to court. It's expensive because it's based on your income. Congrats. You get the county of Difflin. Congrats. You get the, the county of Gowry. Congrats. You get. I actually don't have any duchies. You get the county of Cumberland. So it's just this piece of shit land here. And then all this. I have to keep an eye out over here. Because if these guys show up, it's bad news. Oh, uh, like that. I do not have enough guys to do this war. More tech. That is nice. Let's come all the way up over here and hope that it'll take him so long because he can't travel along rivers. While I can, so he he he. Oh, can I? I can. Oh. This is a wondrous day. I was scared of creating. King. Kingdom of England? Not anymore, because now I'm the Emperor. And it doesn't matter. I'm the goddamn emperor. So they'll take these titles. That's they can do that. That's fine. Is that actually the county I'm on? Yeah, actually it is. You get the Yarldom of Wessex. You in charge of Kent. Uh, you get the Jarldom of Kent. Oh, apparently what a sus... Oh, you'll gain that one too. Grantland, it's what it all encompasses. It's kind of dumb. And I have another duchy I need to give away. The Jarldom of Diflin. Dishonorable. I get a lot of negatives with him. Including short reign because I literally just found it this. It's unusual that you can found it as a uh, still as pagan. Which actually makes this completely insane. 
Uh, you would indeed be a better steward. Congratulations, you're a steward now. Did I get a better chancellor? I got a great chancellor. Did I get a better marshal? I got a great marshal. Did I get a better steward? I got a tremendous steward. Did I get a better spymaster? No. Did I get a better seer? No. The Emperor of Britannia is happy. Uh, I actually should now... I like the, the serpent look of it. I should now be able to have unlimited use of the... Cost of, the subjugation costs below here. Now, in the meantime, I need to be over here paying attention. So we're going to move boat downstream some to inform me if somebody's coming. Because if not, I can do a simple siege here and get some more. Oh, I am indeed the... Uh... He will not accept a white piece. Oh, shit. Get in the boat. Uh, I really can't find a way that given my current my current dumb scoop of mind no get you come come back here oh look at that I got 22 more <laughs> actually he'll have some extras so whatever I'm not gonna complain uh, I need to... I can't pass. Damn. I really need to have a son now. And I guess my goal just goes skyrocketing. Oh, also, I can massively increase the size of my Ratooine now. So we are going to raise fleet levies. Yeah, I don't think I can get enough. True. Why are you coming down here? I don't think I can get enough troops over there to deal with this threat. At least in a single go, it might take me a bit. But, uh, that's alright. Because, uh, I can actually use something even better. I hate how retarded the, ki the, the kingdom of, of Ireland is. Oh, also, I should probably... Oh, of course. This is my province. Uh, Let's increase legalism. Oh, my truce is about to expire. Ah, she is just greedy. A lot of shit happened in this 30 minute episode, so let's call it a break for now while I. I'm going to just leave it paused here and try and formulate what the hell I'm going to do and how I'm going to finish this war out. Hopefully, uh, if I, I can just stall it out to a white piece, but I might have to actually figure out a way to transport troops all that way. We'll figure it out. I want to thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.